Hey, Bolo Buddies, thanks for watching. All right, I have 35 bolos coming your way. These are either gonna be unexpected bread and butter or big money. Most of them are big money bolos, items to be on the lookout for, items that you can hopefully buy low and sell for a really good profit. So I'm gonna tell you where they got it, what they paid for it, and what it sold for. Everybody in this video is a featured Bolo Buddies member. That means they have joined memberships to be in this video. If you would like to check out memberships, it is linked down below in the description. No pressure to join. My channel is completely free. Memberships are just for those that want to get a shout out and a video for their eBay store and their YouTube channel. Those links are linked down in the description of the video. Be sure to check them out. The channels are awesome and the eBay stores are great also. And if you don't know, you can follow eBay stores and see when they list new items. So we are gonna get started here. And the first item comes from Got Junk in Our Trunk. And she does a lot of what sold. She has a really unique way of doing them. She puts them to music and you just watch them. Most of them are between three and five minutes, but some really cool bolos over there. So definitely check her out. But I really like the bolos that she is sharing because they um, actually, I picked up some of these and I turned to her to figure out how to list them. And uh, these are, they're uh, Christian, uh, you, you pass them out at Halloween. So I'm, I'm not really sure. They're called Chick Track and it, it's got little like comics. And I'm pretty sure they're all Christian based. I know the ones I had were Christian based. But anyway. Let's talk about this. She picked up uh, 200 pieces for $10 at the Goodwill bins. Um, so that came to about 10 cents each. This one sold for $16.99. And here's another one that sold for a best offer of $14.99. And she said um, that these sell really good. And that's typically around the price that she gets for one of them. I have mine listed in a lot. So we'll see. I only have like seven or eight of them. I got them out of a mystery box. These are magnets. How cool is that? Um, they're little mini magnets. And right here, you can see she's got it um, next to a ruler. And she picked these up at a yard sale in a lot. So she's got about 75 cents each in them. This coffee one sold for $7.99 plus shipping. And then she also sold this little fan. It's a magnet, but it would also be great for a dollhouse. So pretty cool. She sold this one. Um, I'm sorry. Yeah, the coffee was $7.99. She took a best offer on this fan for $7. She said typically she can get between $7 and $12 plus shipping per magnet. So that is great information. Crafting. Crafting Maniac Treasure Connect. No YouTube channel, but awesome eBay store. Look at these amazing items. I see breakables everywhere. You will not find that in my store. So definitely go and check her out. All right. She sold this Clary Illion Studio Pottery. And she said she had this listed. And somebody on eBay actually reached out to her and told her that it was collectible, who it was made by, and that she had it listed too low. So she increased the price, ended up selling this for $135 on best offer, and she got it at a thrift store for three bucks. So you got to love it when somebody messages you and helps you out, right? The next item she sold is this terracotta art tile signed by artist Helen Michaladias, something like that. I, it's Greek art. And she got this at an antique mall for $5, took a best offer of 90 plus shipping on that. Very cool piece. These curtains she picked up at an eight, an estate sale. It was the last day and it was half off and she ended up getting 44 cents a piece. So she's all in for 88 cents on these. Uh, sold them for 51.95 plus shipping. They are Waverly Imperial single curtain panel with matching valance. The next item comes from Farm Girl Scavenger Noel. She is a bolo finder. She has an awesome YouTube channel over here. Um, right now, she is moving into a new home, renovating it. So she has some renovation videos on here, which is pretty cool. So check those out as well as her reselling videos. But you want to learn about bolos, definitely, definitely check her out. All right, here's her store here. She got this clock, this 1960s clock from General Electric 
for free and she sold it for $49.99 plus shipping. This Duchess Real Needlepoint Wool, 40 skeins of blue dye lot D85 vintage. There's 46 of them here. She got this at an estate sale for five bucks and flipped it for $100 plus shipping. The next item is this Datsun Nissan, Nissan, Datsun Nissan 1970 instrument cluster panel. Is that for a car? I don't know. Huh. Anyway, she got it for free and sold it for $203 plus shipping. The next item here is this 1960s Lane & Company Cow Jumped Over the Moon nursery lamp. So I'm not sure where she was, but she said it was priced either at $25 or $35 at wherever she was. I don't know if it was an estate sale or like a flea market, but everybody kept walking past it saying it wasn't worth it because it had holes, it had defects, it had lots and lots of issues. But she thought that there was somebody that was going to be looking for this. Look at it. It's ripped. And she was right. Somebody ended up buying this from her for $50 and the buyer paid shipping. Is that a chip on its back right? No, I think that's just glare. Um, but anyway, she said memories sell. So see, it's cracked, been repaired. It's just, it's in rough condition and it's still sold for 50 bucks plus shipping. So that is something that you can learn from Noelle Farm Girl Scavenger. So she takes chances on stuff like that. Be Carried Away, another awesome channel. And she has a new video up that I have not gone to watch yet, but how to find free inventory, what sold. Um, I don't know if every single item on here is something she got free or not. I definitely need to go check it out. She is a bolo finder, awesome keywords, and I'm excited to watch that video. So she sold these Manilo Blonic suede kitten heel pumps, pointed toe, blush pink. So as you can see, very detailed title, amazing keywords. She sold this on, uh, I'm sorry, she sold it for full asking price of $229.99 plus shipping. She got these at the Salvation Army for $7.99. She also got these boots at the Salvation Army for $7.99 and flipped them for $148.06. They are Ariat English riding boots and very, very nice boots there. Great price. And this vintage NYC Fayo Schwartz Fifth Avenue Jumbo Stuffed Animal. It's a 36-inch gorilla. His name is Archie. And she got this on a freebie alert for, and she sold it for best offer of $89.99 plus shipping. So I bet this is going to be in her uh, video that I was just talking about right over here. Free items. So definitely excited to see that. Free is so cool. Manny DX44, newer channel here. He um, does put reseller content out, but he has some other content as well. So definitely go check him out. And this is his channel. I'll just kind of scroll through here and you can kind of see some of his other videos. It looks like he does some anime stuff. Um, okay, I don't know how to say this. O R O R O, or O, or O, or O. I don't know. It's a heated vest. We'll just say that with a battery pack. He got this at an Amazon liquidation place and he sold this for $70 plus shipping. These Converse uh, Hello Kitty High Top Sneakers All Star Black. Um, you can see they got Kitty Cat Hello Kitty on the side there. They were his wife's and I think he said she only wore them once or tried them on or something like that. Um, but she didn't, I don't know. Maybe she didn't like them but paid about 15 bucks for those and he sold those for $70 plus shipping. The next item is this Van Gogh, the National Gallery Metal Box 24 watercolor paints. He got these at an Amazon Ben store. He paid $5 for it and sold it for 50 plus shipping. So he does those um, pallets and Amazon like liquidation places. So I do not do that. So that's definitely something you can learn about on his channel if that interests you. The Thrifty Nichols. All right. So definitely check out her channel. She has flea market booths. She also has an eBay store. I can't remember if she sells on any other platforms here. 
I want to say she sells on Poshmark. I thought I saw one of her videos, but I could be mixing it up with somebody else. I watch so many videos, but I know she buys thread up and stuff like that. So definitely sub her up. And let's look at her bolos this uh, for this video. She got, oops, I'm in her store. All right, let's try this again. Cavu, I'm not sure if I'm saying that right. It's a backpack. It's really a like one of those side shoulder bags. I actually just picked one of those up at the bins. It's not this brand. I think mine is, is it Land's In or J. Crew? I don't know what it is, but I'm like, I'm keeping this. So I bought something at the bins, the Goodwill bins to keep. So it should be in one of my videos coming up. All right. So she got this at a children's consignment shop. It was like a church sale consignment deal. She paid $7.50 for it and she sold this for $75 plus shipping. The next item here is this Justice League action swamp thing figure four and a half inches she got this in a consignment sale it was a bunch of toys and she had about 10 cents in this and it sold for 24.99 plus shipping the next item is this 1986 applause dog it's a basset hound it's a sad sam he's a 10 inch puppy dog and she got him at the goodwill for a buck and she flipped him for 25 dollars plus shipping the next item comes from Money Making Mama, and she goes into a place called Dirt Cheap, and she bundles items, and she sells them in lots. So uh, definitely check her out. She's got a unique channel, and she's doing different things over there. Does She does like the health and beauty and stuff, but Dirt Cheap is the store she gets it at. All right. So this is a Travel Smart converter or standard wattage converter adapter plug. So she said she got this in a bargain buggy at dirt cheap so i don't know what a bargain buddy is or, or a bargain buggy is i haven't watched the video yet but she has a video showing you what this bargain buddy is and what she got out of it so go check that out she paid ten dollars for everything that she got so she's got about a quarter in this and she sold it for 34 dollars 99 plus shipping all right, these lego classics um 60 piece building set so it looks like there's eight of them. And she got these for 25 cents each at a yard sale. And she sold the lot for $28.99 plus shipping. The next item comes from Flippin' It Good. And he is a retail arbitrage machine. This guy finds big money bolos in stores like Burlington and Ross and different places. He's also doing um, Lost Cargo now. And he also finds stuff at yard sales. He just is, he's got a great eye. He got this Cabbage Patch Kid and it was missing its shoes at a yard sale for four bucks. And he took a best offer of $80 on that one. The next item is this Polo Ralph Lorenz uh, denim jacket. And I love his photo here. That's just really looks good. He got this at Ross for 20 bucks and he sold it for 160 plus shipping. And the next item is this Nikon digital camera. He got it at a yard sale. He did pay up for this. He paid $100 for it and he sold it for $180 plus shipping. The next item comes from Mom Knows Treasures. She does not have a YouTube channel, but she has a very cool eBay store. So definitely check her out. She is a bolo finder. She finds some really awesome stuff. So um, let's see what we got here. This is a Bonnie Pointer. Oh boy. I, I'm guessing that's another language. It says, heaven must have sent you rare Mexico red 1777. So it's an LP record. And how cool is that? She sold this for $40. She picked this up in a lot of records from auctions for you. So if you don't know, auctions for you is a YouTube channel that sells inventory to resellers. So she picked up um, a record lot. So definitely um, very cool. And I do have auctions for you linked down in the description. You guys have heard me talk about her before. I purchase from her and Donatella Bottolino all the time. So the next item she sold is this Lago Di Como King Cali King Deve cover. And it's made in Italy. That is fancy. She said it was a gift and she ended up selling it on best offer for $225 plus shipping. The next item she got from Mr. Buys a Lot, who is also a YouTube channel that auctions stuff off to resellers like us. So check out Mr. Buys a Lot. He is awesome. He has a great channel, awesome inventory, just like this. 
a rare new Mattel Charmin chatty doll. Let's play tea party. She did pay up a little for this. She paid $50 for it. It sold in 12 hours for $139.99 plus shipping. The next item comes from Groundhog eBay store. And again, lots of unique items. Uh, whoa, what is going on there? Gant Gots G O T Z doll, huh? That's interesting. Is it like for a dollhouse? Lots of interesting items. Don't bother me. I'm having a crisis. And look at the mug. How funny is that? All right. Let's see here what we what she sold. She sold this pressure cooker. She bought it for her mom, and her mom did not use it. So she ended up flipping it on eBay for $140 plus shipping. It's Nesco brand. The next item is this vintage 1970s Jeep Snow Pat AMC racing jacket. She got this at a rummage sale for 20 bucks. She took a best offer of $100 plus shipping on that. The next item are these vintage The Children's Hour books from 1953. Complete set of 16 with great graphics. And you can see here she's got a photograph of one of the pages. Um, she got this at a high bid auction for 10 bucks, and she sold these for $99.99 plus shipping. Electric Garage Sale. He has a really cool store, and he does estate sale cleanouts. So basically, I don't know if they pay him to clean it out or if he just gets the stuff if he cleans it out. But the items that I'm about to show you, he got free because he cleaned out the estate. So nothing like source and free, right? But it is hard work. So he got this vintage Stanley number 71-1 slash two wood router plane. And he paid nothing for this because it was an estate clean out labor only. And he sold it for $169.95 plus shipping. The next one is this vintage McCormick Deering. Uh, it's a brochure. How awesome is that? Again, labor clean out for an estate sale. He sold this for $54.95 plus shipping. The next item here is this How To Box by Joe Lewis. And he sold this for $64.95 plus shipping. And this was also an estate clean out labor only. The next item comes from Three Ducks Resale. This is her eBay store. Again, no store, but it will be linked below so that you can go in and look through the items just like I am doing here. Very, very cool stuff. Lots of breakables. Eek. All right, let's see what we got here. This Blinko or Blanco, I'm not sure how to pronounce it. Cobalt blue um, with this snake looking thing around it. She got this at a Goodwill for 10 bucks and she sold this for $75 plus shipping. The next item here is this McKenzie Child's retired 2004 Courtly Check flower pot. She got this at a Goodwill for $4.75 plus shipping. Or, I'm sorry, she got it for, she paid $4.75 and she sold it for $137.50 plus shipping. All right, let's see here. Try, I want to see the markings on the bottom. I don't know. I don't know how you, uh, I don't know how she knew it was Mackenzie Childs. So I don't know much about pottery, so... And the next item she sold are these Southern Living Red Metal Wall Shelf Triangle Shape Brass Tone Star. Um, she got this at the Goodwill for $8 and sold it for $32 plus shipping. All right, you guys, that was 35 bolos. Let me know in the comments, what was your favorite bolo? Or maybe which item most surprised you that you didn't know about that you're definitely going to be on the lookout for? Um, my name's Courtney, if I didn't tell you that, and I'm also known as Bolo Buddies. I have this channel, I have Sourcing with Bolo Buddies, and I have Reseller Testing Bolo Products. Those channels are linked down below if you want to check me out over there as well, along with other links for items that I use for my business and different platforms that I sell on. So check out the description and the comments. I should have some other videos linked, and there's going to be some videos popping up here and here, a subscribe button and another video, and thanks for watching.